Sega Genesis Classics. This game is, without a shadow of a doubt, the go-to way to play Sega Genesis games. Unless, of course, you count Sega Genesis Online. And I gotta tell ya, I am forever thankful to this app for allowing me to play some of my old favorite Sega Genesis games. The intro for this is tr truly spectacular. You're, it's like you're in your bedroom and you're playing through the old school Sega Genesis games. Games like Golden Axe, games like Columns, games like Space Harrier, games like Shinobi, Gunstar Heroes, Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Toe Jam and Earl, and I am forever, forever thankful that this was on the Nintendo Switch. Although, for Nintendo Switch Online users, the Sega Genesis uh, Online is the way to go. If you want something offline, this is the go-to when it comes to playing classic games. And I was a Sega Genesis fanboy as strong as I was a Nintendo guy, and that is saying a lot. And if you guys remember correctly, during my uh, Sega Shorts uh, video, I am madly in love with the classics. Truly, truly. I can't get enough of it. I am a Sega Genesis fanboy. But anyway, as I'm scrolling through the games, I decided, let's play some classic columns. Hey? <laughs> because when it comes to Sega Genesis, I could not get enough of Columns. Columns was my go-to game, and one of the games that I would play besides Tetris, especially Super Tetris when I got the Super Nintendo emulator back then, way, way back then. But yeah, Columns holds a very precious place in my heart because I did not really have the original cartridge, but I played it on the Sega Genesis 6-pack. And for those of you who don't know what the Sega Genesis 6 pack is, the Sega Genesis 6 pack was six games on the Sega Genesis rolled into one lovely, neatly packed cartridge. You had the original Sonic 1, you had Super Hang On, Columns, Streets of Rage, uh, Golden Axe, and Revenge of Shinobi before all the, uh, the uh, copyright stuff in Revenge of Shinobi got taken down and everything like that because you had to fight with Batman, you had to fight with Spider-Man, and even Mechagodzilla, which was so cool. <laughs> uh, nowadays, I think you have to download a ROM, emu a ROM of the original uh, Revenge of Shinobi just to uh, play uh, and fight Spider-Man and Batman. Uh, but anyway, I'm done talking. I'm gonna play some classic columns, so enjoy the gameplay footage, you peeps. And if you like what you see, leave a like and comment, and subscribe for more.
My only complaint though, when it comes to playing this game, is that it doesn't have everything that Sonic's Ultimate Genesis Collection on PS3 and I guess the Xbox 360 has, because in that game, Sonic's Ultimate Genesis Collection, you could play the original Shinobi that was in arcades. You could also play, uh, what was it? Alien, Alien Syndrome, and uh, I think also, you could also play uh, Golden Axe, uh, Golden Warrior, what, what was the original game called? And, uh, oh yeah, you could play the original Fantasy Star game. That is the only complaint I have toward uh, the Sega Genesis Classics, and uh, that's unfortunate. My PS3 tends to have a love-hate relationship toward Sonic's Ultimate Genesis Collection because sometimes it reads it and sometimes it does not. I don't know what the deal is with the disc. I don't know if it's a disc problem or a hardware problem. But regardless though, I am thankful for this collection because I can play some of the games I didn't play back then on Sega Genesis or that was in collaboration collections. And if I really want to, I can play Sega Genesis Online because I get to play Aisha Dragoon, Dra uh, Dragoon, as well as other games. And I haven't looked at Sega Genesis Collect, uh, Sega Genesis Online for a while. Maybe I'll try and see if Super Hang On is on. Uh, Super Hang On is on there, and if that's the case, then then I'll have it made because uh, I never did beat Super Hang On. I beat Golden Axe, I beat the original Sonic 1 without cheating, uh, played Columns a lot, uh, Streets of Rage 1 I beat, and uh, I did not ever really come close to beating uh, Revenge of Shinobi back then. That was uh, uh, when, <coughs> I guess, technology was advancing and I put my uh, Sega Genesis out in the storage room one time, but yeah. Regardless though, I hope you peeps enjoyed the uh, rest of the video as it plays out, and if this video does well, I'll do some more ga classic gaming with Sega Genesis Collection. But for now, I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna sign out for the time being. If you guys like what you see, leave a like, leave a comment, and click on the subscribe bell for more. Also, what was your favorite Sega Genesis classic game growing up? I'll see you guys next time. Until then, peace.